this is something that I believe in. This is a product that I believe in. You go make your own decision about that. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to sit here and tell you that you need to get it. I, I want and you to push. Be, just and, and look, look at it. You look present at it. it and exactly. I actually just um, did a post yesterday. Today's Tuesday. Yesterday, yes, um, for a jewelry company, and it's all their all of their items are m made in the U.S. Um, ethically and sustainably, and I didn't even mention anything about the jewelry. I just basically put something like because it was a picture of me looking in the mirror, putting the earring on, and I said look in the mirror that's your competition and i didn't even mention anything about the jewelry mm. they got so many new followers and so many requests about their product so you just because, added the jewelry company but you didn't right, talk about it i didn't talk about okay, it. okay okay so i think when you don't try to push something you know yeah. <laughs> people, same with veganism if you want to turn people vegan right exactly you, you cannot you cannot build walls with people it, it's not going anywhere i mean i know it's very I, I feel like in the beginning when I just started bec becoming vegan, like I had so many problems with people who weren't vegans, you know, and mm. it, it was just going nowhere. I mean, it literally was going nowhere other than making me upset and making me irritable. And now I, I just use those um, conversations as a place of starting the conversation. Yeah. Have you thought about this? Have you thought about that? Have you thought about skipping turkey this year? Have you thought about doing tofurkey? I mean, whatever that is, and just be more accepting of where they are. Because, you know, wherever they are, we used to be there. I used to be there. Yeah, all of it. For yeah. almost, <laughs> very few people, I don't know anybody who was actually raised vegan. We we have had a couple guests We just know are... Siba Johnson vegan since birth. It's oh, the only oh, person yeah. I know yeah, that Siba. everything, wow. yeah, there's a lot of veg since birth, like Nima right. Delgado's veg right, since right. birth. Yeah, yeah there's Tyler, more of that. Too, yeah, yeah, Nick. Mm -hmm. But yeah, the vegan since birth is, yeah. We're going to start look... seeing it though, right? As we move along. Exactly. Right? Yeah, the babies right, are cause... being, you yes. know, this, right. <laughs> they're raising yeah. them right now. <laughs> so, so that's a, a really interesting um, mm -hmm. ethic that I really am impressed by. Um, what other things do you, when you come, when you come to a company, you say, this is what, this is what you need. A lot of people will just represent any old company, but you yeah. obviously have very high standards. Well, yeah. I've turned down more offers than I've actually said yes. And in the last, you have and I've had like 300, 300 brands, brands uh, but that's not even half of what I've been offered, you know? So wow. it's, it's a lot of no's like Uggs one time were basically emailing me every month. No, no, no. If you are interested in developing a vegan shoe line, I will be able to talk to you, you know? So they said, okay, maybe next year. So I don't know, maybe next year it will happen, but um, McDonald's, I'm not even sure why they even got That's it. That's insane. <laughs> are they even <laughs> reading your feed? <laughs> I'm just like, oh, okay. Now, if there was a, if there was a, oh, uh, a vegan, if there was a vegan something at McDonald's, would you I can't, right. yeah. you know, I, I'm, I'm so sorry. sorry. <laughs> no, no, I'm That's just like, wondering, yeah, you know, we I, all, you're drawing lines. Like, right. We're really crossing the line. Nah. <laughs> for Uggs, you might do a certain boot, but for McDonald's, uh, no, no, because right. it's carcinogenic that you're putting in your body. Right. I mean, I just cannot do that. And I actually do yeah. think that they're going to hate, get hate mails from my followers. I really do. Like when I say no, it's not like for my ego. I really do think that it's not the best partnership. Mm, and for I, them think, I think for... it's actually going to backfire for the mm -hmm. brand. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah, so I said a lot of no's and it's fine, you know, because the right the right jobs will come along. I just I've always had that faith. You know? Hey, so... folks. OK, back by very popular demand is our plant powered plate fridge magnet, which you are going to receive for free if you leave us a rating and a review on whatever platform you're listening to this podcast on. So here are the details. Just write your quick review. Does not need to be long. Does not need to be a whole story. Just be honest and speak from the heart. Then take a quick screenshot of the review you wrote and email it to us at podcast at switchforgood.org. That's podcast at switchforgood.org. And include your mailing address so we can send you a power plate. We are doing this because the more reviews we garner, the higher we go in search results, which means more folks will learn about our podcast. So the power is in your hands. Leave us a review and zoom, zoom, your power plate arrives at your doorstep. So thank you so much for tuning in today. If we helped you in any way, then click the subscribe button and let's keep hanging out together. We have so much more to share with you. And if you need more information on actually making the switch for good, please visit us at switchforgood.org for loads of info. And you can subscribe to our mailing list where you will receive all sorts of super cool gifts, discount codes to our very fave dairy-free products, and a lifetime of powerful health tips. So join us on the journey to switch for good. This 
is the future.